Come on and get on down to the city, the city. where the trains all clatter through. Hey, look at that driver driving. I want to ride that train on blue. I'm looking way up high to the windy. Take a peek from inside view. All those people busy working. I want to see what they all do. Come on, let's weave round the market. Until you hear that hullabaloo. Everybody's busy selling. I want to buy me something new. Look through the arches under the station. Down where the pigeons perch and coo. Take a taxi ride to the river. I want to drive down the avenue. Hey, look at those buses gleaming. They look so clean and spanking new. All lined up to drive around the city. Let me ting that bell to the loo. I'm gonna ride on round to the school stop. Where the children hurry through. Sit down, the teacher's teaching. I'd love to learn a thing or two. Me too. I love to skip in river seeping. Hello, honey pie. Come on, we in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has one at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home too. Well, there's you, but someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Come on, Lisa. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Yes, it's Raymond with Lisa coming down the steps. Hello, Raymond. Hi, Granny Murray. Hello, Lisa, my darling. Hello. Come on through. Granny Murray, can I have a biscuit out of your tent? No, Lisa. You've only just had your breakfast. Oh. Why don't you go and get yourself a tangerine from the fruit bowl? Daddy won't mind that. No, no, that's fine. Ooh, thank you. So, what are you up to today, Granny Murray? We're going to have a walk up to the castle and back. Oh, I love visiting the castle. I get quite carried away imagining I'm a knight of old in my armour. Oh, yes, clanking about. Looking over the battlements. You can see for miles. Firing the big cannon. What are you eating, Raymond? Just one of your biscuits. I hope you don't mind. Raymond, you just told Lisa she couldn't have a biscuit. I know, but... Always take the advice you give. I'm sorry, Granny Murray. Well... I better be off to work. Come and give your dad a big hug. Goodbye, Lisa. Bye, Dad. Bye, bye, Lisa. <laughs> Away you go, my boy, Raymond. Now you have a fun day, Granny Murray. You too. And remember, always take the advice you give. I'll remember. We'll be thinking of you. Me too. Now then, Honey Pie, you keep an eye on Raymond and make sure he goes the right way to the train station. On my way to work. Shoes through the city views Stepping along, I'm swinging my arms Singing my way through the city's charms Okay, which way? Do I go left now, or do I go right? Which way is wrong now, and which way is right? (laughs) Ah yes, right to the train station You told me the way I go Thank you, you showed me the way I know. Thanks for getting me to the train station. Now what? Oh yes, I need to put on my uniform for work. My smart black trousers, my red waistcoat, and my red bow tie. All smart and ready for work. My buffy car is looking clean, neat and tidy. Well stocked up with all the foods my customers like. Now, these are their favourites at the moment. OT biscuits. I've had to stock up with loads of OT biscuits. They're so popular. Oh, we're off. Bang on time. Good morning, Raymond. Dr Juno, my first customer of the day. What can I get you? Uh, Tea? Coffee? Oh, I'm fine for now, but we need to talk business. Oh, uh, are you setting up a hospital clinic in my buffet car? Not quite, but I've had a chat with your manager and he said I can give you these leaflets to hand out. Oh, They look colourful leaflets with all sorts of delicious looking fruits. They're leaflets to hand out with all your snacks. Mm, My customers will like those. Yep, but read what the leaflet says. Um, Don't take the biscuit 
take the fruit. Good healthy advice, eh, Raymond? Oh, yes, Dr. Juno, I like it. I'm always telling Lisa, eat fruit, not biscuits. Good for you. But it's hard to keep Lisa away from the biscuit tin, though. Well, as long as you try. Now, will you give these leaflets out for me? Of course, it's good advice. Don't take the biscuit. Take the fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Raymond. See you later. See ya. Right. I'd better get down to some hard work. I love my train. I'm so happy being me. Doing all the things I love to do. Lemonade or tea I'm just very happy serving you Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day Wheeling trolleys, weaving to this way I'll do a trick and make the journey quick Oh, I walk, walk, walk each way Loving all the things I do each day Bringing smiles and happiness my way I love my train Yes, sirree, I have had a swell morning's work. I have never sold so many OT biscuits. Oh, and I've given away lots of Dr Juno's leaflets. Hello, Raymond. Hi, Mickey John. So, what can I interest you in? A coffee, please. One coffee coming up. And uh, something to nibble. Well, the OT biscuits are very popular. Oh, that sounds tasty. I'll have an OT biscuit then. There's your coffee, Mickey John. Thank you. And one OT biscuit. Oh, and every customer has one of these fruity leaflets from Dr. Juno. Oh, let's read what this leaflet says then. Don't take the biscuit, take the fruit. Well, that's good advice, eh? Yes, good advice. I'll have some fruit, please, instead of the biscuit then. Oh, I'm sorry. There is no fruit, Mickey John. No fruit? Well, yeah, there's not much demand for fruit. People love the Oti biscuits. In fact, I think I'll have one myself. Well, it does look tasty. Hmm, well, £2.50, please. Thanks. I'll see you soon. Bye, Raymond. Mmm. Mmm. This OT biscuit tastes great. <laughs> Lisa would love it. Lisa should be up at the castle with Granny Murray now. Up the castle steps we go. Nearly there, Granny Murray. Oh, yes. Oh, there we are. Lots of people. Yes. They're all here to see the big cannon fired. There's the big cannon, Granny Murray. Yes. Now, at one o'clock, any second now, that soldier is going to fire the big cannon. Why? Just to tell everybody it's one o'clock. He's stamping along. He, he's marching up to the cannon. Will it go bang, Granny Murray? Yes. So put your hands over your ears. One, two, three. Oh, my goodness. What a loud bang. I can't hear a thing. Did he put your hands over your ears, Granny Murray? What, dear? Oh, no, I forgot. I wonder if your daddy heard that big bang on his train. Where are you, daddy? Are you on your train? I'm thinking of you, daddy. Ah, Lisa. I hope you put your hands over your ears when the big cannon went bang. Hello, Raymond. <laughs> oh, hello, Nurse Henry. What can I get you? A tea, for starters. A tea is on its way. Oh, maybe you'd like an OT biscuit. Maybe. Oh, I see you're giving out Dr Juno's leaflets. Oh, yes, they're very popular. Don't take the biscuit, take the fruit. It's good advice. I'm handing them out to everyone. I'll take the fruit, then. Pardon? I won't have the biscuits. I'll have the fruit instead. Sorry, Nurse Henry. We don't have any fruit. There's not much demand for it. Sorry, Raymond. Forget the tea. I won't have anything. Oh, what's getting to him? What have I done wrong? What did Granny Murray say? Remember, always take the advice you give. Always take the advice you give. Well, I'm telling people to eat fruit, and I'm selling them biscuits, so I'm not taking the advice I give. I need to get some fruit on this train. At the next station, I'm going to get off the train and put things right. It's a race against time. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song What can I get you, Gov? I'll have five bags of apples, five bunches of bananas and five bags of oranges There you go, Gov Oh, thank you Now back to the train Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song 
just in time. And we're off. Raymond's, I came to apologise for being a bit huffy. No, Nurse Henry, I took your advice and filled the boofy car with fruit. Now, I advise you to take the fruit and not the biscuit. Then I'll have a banana, please. One banana coming up. And now, on with the rest of my day's work. And then I can go and pick up Lisa from Granny Murray's. Who's that coming through the gate, Lisa? Daddy! Yes, Raymond. Hello, Daddy. Hi, Lisa. Did you see the big cannon at the castle? Yeah, it went bang! Lisa put her hands over her ears. But I forgot to take my own advice, and I was deafened for ages. I did the same thing, Granny Murray, until I remembered what you said. Always take the advice you give. It saved the day, thank you. Well, I never. Right, you two, away home you go. Thank you for looking after me, Granny Murray. Oh, and thank you, Lisa, for looking after me. Come on, Lisa. Let's talk about our time away. And I suppose you, my honey pie, will want to know all about my time too. Well, there was waving, greeting, hello, meeting, bye bye, closing, waking, dozing, eating, sleeping, fetching, sketching, painting, stretching, gluing, chewing, sticking up and wiping round, washing up and slushing down. Then there was hugging, squishing, rocking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shading, choosing, talking, cooking, drying, cleaning, saving, cleaning, loving, joking, using things. Today I took Lisa to the castle to see the big cannon and what a bang it made. Did you enjoy yourself? <laughs> Me too. I love to skip in river sleeping, go river sleeping, go by the sea. I love to skip in river sleeping, go river sleeping, go back for me. Bye bye, honey pie. I love to skip in river sleeping, go river sleeping, go by the sea. I love to City, where the fairy folk stands the blue. Time to call on Granny Marie. 